okay hello friends jesus here uh, today in this video i want to show you uh, how to copy okay one program from one server to other using ftp okay uh, this was a question by uh, one of my friend so i just want to make a video so what i'm going to do i'm going to show you how to download a particular file or a program from what mobile pdm say for example i took this program uh, which is there in pub 400 uh, or oh, happened in, in this profile uh, 68 i just want to bring this program from here to this particular uh, 69 profile okay let's see how to do that so first of all i'm i'm logged in uh, into my folder called file okay so it's my pc so i'm going to say something like uh, ftp pop400.com so we are, i'm just going in as a normal pop400 ftp and then i'm giving the first user id okay because i want to download the file and then uh, upload it to the user 69 so now the first point is if i try pwd right you get this kind of message okay then it's called name format one sometimes you will get a message like qgpl is your current directory like that that is called name format zero so uh, if you get a name format zero you need to change it to name format one by using this command okay quote site name fmt1 if you do this it will change it to name format one fine if you are in name format one then we can access this particular guy uh, using the ifs pattern this i have already explained in one video i'll explain it again so working qsys.lib uh, okay i'll tell you how because so this test if is available in what qrpgle src okay and this qrpgle src is available where it's available in q user 00681 okay if i type work object user 00681 slash qrpgle src I get what this is available into this library if we further go and check work object user 00681 it is available in qsys library so qsys is actually a root kind of stuff okay so then which means work link qsys dot lib so qsys is lib slash user 00681 right this is a object dot lib because it is also a lib then qrpg lesrc dot file because qrpg lesrc is a file that's what we see if you go enter you will be see seeing this file like this so if you go file you will be able to see all the members like this so we are going to use this pattern to bring the program uh, download the program okay so i'm saying cd q u q sys dot lib okay in q sys lib i'm going to say uh, now there is no slash okay user 00681 dot lib okay now i'm gonna say cd qrpg lesrc dot uh, file because it's a file okay uh, yeah so now if you put a ls i'll be able to see all the members here now i want to download the test if dot members so i'm going to say get test if dot mbr so once you do this right i'll be able to see the file downloaded uh, in my thing in my desktop okay and then i can just say right click open with notepad you'll be able to see the data now how do we upload this back to the uh, server okay so i'm going to say quit okay uh, ft okay let me clear this ftp for 400.com uh, so i'm going to say like 0068 not 69 it's a new user so use 0069 okay so now i'm going in so pwd it shows this is my current directory which is okay so this is my uh, 691 okay currently that is the test if is not there okay so yeah so what i'm going to do now uh, i'm going to use cd again so qsys.lib uh, cd uh user 00691.lib cd uh qrpg lesrc src dot file okay now this is our current directory now i can say put uh test if dot mbr now this will go and then upload it if you go and see right fi you will be able to see the data but there is no type because there is no type if you go down you will see the data but the system will not understand it's rpg only so how to get this type so you can use shift f6 okay and then change this change type and text to y temporarily and then type rpg here enter then again go to shift f6 and then change the value to no 
okay now if you go for it it's a rpg libre program so you can just compile and run it like like a normal program so this is what i want to cover so i hope this helps let me know if you have any doubts thanks for watching